Hi, my name is Patty Dubroff. I was Charlize's makeup artist on The Huntsman Winter War, and I'm going to show you a couple of Queen Ravana's looks. I'm going to start with the look when she emerges from the mirror, gold is flying everywhere, and this is what remains. It's kind of like a beautiful gold flake mask. So for this look, what's really important is that there's a purity underneath, and then the gold flex is what is really the statement. So the skin has been prepped, a little bit of foundation, not too much, um, just a slight amount of contour, brows really nothing, just let your brows be, curl the eyelashes. It's a very uh, pure face. So this is just a neutral brown eyeshadow. I'm going to just give a little bit of like contour to the eye, not too much, just so that the socket goes back and the eyelid will pop. For the lid, I'm just gonna put a little bit of a cream light just to make the base of the lid quite even and fair so the gold really pops. I'm gonna put a little bit of gold shadow on the lid, right in the center of the lid, popping some gold. Keeping the brightness around the eyes, so I'm gonna put a light kind of flesh tone eye pencil on the inner rim. A really nice gold accent on the inner corner of the eye almost so that you don't have to put the flake there. I'm also going to use a gold cream with a small brush, and I'm going to accentuate the inner corner with the gold cream, and I'm gonna accentuate the eyeliner with this gold cream. So it really, really pops gold metallic on the lid. If there's anything left on the brush, you can add a little more gold to the lip line, to the Cupid's bow. The way that the gold flakes came about is Charlize came into the makeup trailer and she had had a dream the night before where she saw these gold flakes kind of they were going to be coming off of her body everywhere but that the gold flakes would be on her skin. I wasn't prepared for that. Um, I, we kind of figured out that it would take gold leaf. So I ran to the makeup trailer next door where the, uh, the, the head of makeup, hair and makeup team was. And thankfully they had gold leaf sheets and they had these gold flakes. These are something that you can find in an art supply store. So you can get gold leaf sheets and break them apart, but it's very time consuming. And actually I found that this worked a lot better. So the application of the gold leaf, first of all, you have to get prepared to have gold leaf everywhere. Um, and to have the gold leaf stay exactly where you want it to stay. What I found worked best was using balms, lip balms. So this is like pawpaw cream, which is like an ointment. This is uh, another type of ointment. You can use Vaseline if you have that. Anything greasy and ointment-y. And uh, I wouldn't use eyelash glue. I've seen people do tutorials saying use eyelash glue. It's way too heavy and dense. It's unnecessary. This will hold it just fine. It's much more gentle for the skin also. So what I did was I applied the balm kind of in the area where I want the gold flex to be. Now that the balm is laid down, then I'm just gonna start placing flakes. And it's nothing too perfect or precise. It's, you see the balm, they just kind of stick right onto the balm. On the eyelid, I found it was most beautiful to leave the eyelid open and really focus on above the brow, on the brow area. The important thing is really making sure to follow the shape of the eye. And that's so that it's no further down than the corner of the eye, not going below the corner of the eye. It's this upward streak. And then you might find that you need a little bit more balm. I would also press them down with something that has a bomb on it to secure them. After the gold flakes are on, then I would just take a dry, clean brush and just kind of tap around to give them a little extra security so you know that the, the bomb is holding the gold flakes on. And then as a final touch, I just Take a little bit of a gold pencil, add a few more points. This look has no mascara. It, I feel like mascara would take away from the purity and the gold and all the lightness. And there you have it, that's Queen Ravenna's gold flake look.